data transfer from python code to file abc.txt these are three lines of small python code if i run this code abc.txt will create here and data transfer from python code to file abc.txt let's begin this is my python ide in simple words we create a program to enter a string in a python and that string store in a text file permanently for this this is my new program before before uh, going further this is very important thing please note uh, look if i click on the save by default this is the location of install directory this path is too long and every time open a file from this location is very very time consuming so first of all you create a file in uh, my computer uh, any folder in my computer for example in c drive i create a new folder neha now this is the location where i save my program now i cascade two windows side by side so you can understand a better what is file handling is Now I start writing a code, f is equal to open any file, any text file, a, b, c, x, y, z, and w. Please look at the syntax. Here, f is a file object, also called file handle. And open function, as name suggested, is it open our file xyz.txt. If file is already in our computer, it will open. If it is not, it will create it. Now look. If I click on save, in my directory Neha, I take, a, I name it file underscore write, save. Now look, this is our Python module. Now look carefully. If I run this code, single line code, now here xyz.txt is created it is created automatically xyz.txt look again if uh, the file is abc.txt that area is blank that area is blank i run this code okay now abc.txt will appear here now it was appeared here it is created abc.txt now working with abc.txt we move further so i delete xyz now look at the code again now look the content of abc.txt is blank now i write uh, next line file handle f you can write any name fabc dot write write function to write a string to file abc.txt any string for example hello to all to my file abc.txt in last f dot close means open opposite of, opposite of open function is close means out from the memory means from the ram open function open is not in your computer it is in your memory ram now i run this code Now, see the content. Hello to all. Now, it's not blank. It is hello to all. Means f dot write writes hello to all to abc.txt. Now, I close it. Now, remember every time file is overwrite. Overwrite means old content was removed and new content was added. Now, welcome to all. I run this code. Now, see. Look at the content of abc.txt. It's not hello to all, it is welcome to all. So file was overwritten. Now this is my first line. This is my location. Neha file write.py. ABC was created in that folder. Now if you want to change the path of my abc.txt, means I want this or create ho. It will create it some another place. For example, e drive folder ram remember ram folder must be exist but use double slash look i use double slash why because single slash is meant for escape sequence has special meaning now i run this code now look this is my ram folder 
Now, the content of my file is welcome to all. If you want to create a file abc.txt in RAM folder, you can specify the path. But with double slash, if you use single slash, if you use single slash, this is error. This is error. Invalid argument. So always use double slash or you can use R. R by prefixing before a path. R is here. R is raw string. Now you can use slash single slash also. Now you can use single slash also by prefixing R. Now if I run this code, code is running it means there is no error. Now come back to our original code. This is abc.txt in uh, same Neha folder. It will create a file abc.txt in Neha folder and uh, content of file are welcome to all. So let's move uh, now move further. Now if I enter a string at a runtime, if I enter a string at a runtime, for example, s is equal to input. This is a input function used to enter a string at a runtime and to any string. After running, after running this code. Now I replace this with S. Now if I running this code and enter any string at a runtime into S, that string is stored in abc.txt. For example, once there was a crow. This is a story of Thirsty Crow. This is the first line of Thirsty Crow story uh, learned in childhood. Now the, the content of abc.txt is once there was a crow. So you can enter a single line single string entering at a runtime you can add multiple lines to a file also by using loop you can add multiple lines to your file also for this i take a variable n int this is an integer input how many lines and is used for entering how many lines Here I use for loop with the range function. Range n means if I enter 5, loop is 0 to 4, means 5 time loop will execute and 5 string added to my file abc.txt. Now I run this code. How many lines? For example, 3 for string hello, welcome to all. Now, surprise for you. The output little bit uh, output gives you a little bit of surprise hello welcome welcome to all hello is first string welcome is second to all is third but all are in same line but all are in same line what is the reason reason that the write function will simply write the content in the file without adding any extra character now i suffix slash n now four lines hello to all now new line character written after every string new line character slash n written after every string hello to all students write function write only string to a file what happened if we taking a list of string so we shall use write lines in place of write function which writes the content of a list to a file remember list to a file i take an empty string i append all string with list l and instead of function write i must write write lines otherwise it kill it will give error if we write l now look two strings once 
there now right argument must be string not list it means right is meant only for the string not the list for list we must use right lines we use right lines right lines l l is our list of string Now again, don't forget to suffix slash n. Now run this code. How many lines? Three. Enter string. Hello, Mr. Smith. Now there is question for you. If I include right lines to my in my loop, if I include right lines in my loop, so what is the output means? What is the content of my file abc.txt? For example, I enter three lines. Hello, Mr. Smith. Now what is the content of my file abc dot? txt there is a question for you think i will show you answer 